Hi everyone, it's Gail, and I am here today with kind of a random make sort of a video. I have stuff all over my desk and all over my floor um, from my retreat last week, and I just want to make some stuff with these things and just kind of get them get them on their way. I don't want to put to-do things back in the to-do box if I can help it. I want to I want to make a few things out of them. So, I'm going to say hi and hugs to Susie and Tori and Robin. Thank you so much for watching and your kind comments. And then I am I just going to just going to make some stuff and and chat and all that kind of stuff. So I finished this um, collage that was just on copy paper that I'm going to do the fun little, um, the, the little cluster, uh, mixed media cluster thing with. But I'm going to set that aside for the moment and work on some bigger stuff. So I did these yesterday and I want to use them. So let's let's figure out something to use them. I I grabbed this. It's all sewn and everything. What I it's I don't love it and so I haven't used it, but I am going to use I'm going to put one of the um the little tracing paper collages on there and I think it's gonna be awesome so so that video was just yesterday's mixed media Monday video that I made those so just FYI so yeah I just have lots of stuff to put away and I thought you know what if I can make stuff with some of this stuff then I'm just gonna do it so I think I like the pink on this and I think I might like that. So, if I do below there and there, I think that would be okay. Okay, so just figuring out where to cut it. So, uh, yeah, so interestingly, I mean, I, I, do, I do have something to chat about, which is... Um, this morning, uh, in our newspaper, there was a, you know, one of the small magazines that they put in those, and there was a thing about Brew, Drew Barrymore in there, and she was talking about when she started doing her, um, her talk show, which I have never watched, but, um, she was saying that she got a lot of comments about, see, now that will be cute. Might put some lace on that or something. Anyway, about that she was too, you know, excited and talked too fast and this, that, and the other thing. And, you know, I, it, it just kind of struck a chord because I was kind of going, oh, I really want to finish up this stuff on my desk. But I've had a few people say, I hate collage. And so then I second guess myself about doing a collage video. So anyway, um, she was saying when she got those, uh, those, not positive comments, let's say, that it made her question herself. And um, I don't know, it was wonderful timing for that kind of to come, come to my attention because I thought, you know what? I feel like that sometimes too. Like you get a, get kind of a, it doesn't even have to be a nasty comment, just a comment saying, you know, I don't like what you're doing. And it just kind of makes you feel like, what, well, <laughs> what should I do? Okay, so, but um, these are from Artsology, these words, and I thought they might be kind of fun to, oh, heavenly, that would be cute on there. I think I might put that up there for fun. So, anyways, back to my 
philosophical discussion here. So, and it's funny because whenever people ask me for advice for their YouTube channels, I always, always, always say, just be yourself because it's too hard to be anything else. And just be yourself. Do what you want to do. Do what brings you joy. And um, it will all will be well. So um, I just thought today I need to listen to my own advice a little bit more. And um, yeah. So anyway, that happened this morning. And so I was like, you know what? I really want to work with on this stuff that's on my desk so that's a what am i going gonna do and so it'll be good yeah yeah it's um you know it's just hard in this age of social media it's um i mean i'm very appreciative because i would be able to do what i do if there was no such thing but at the same time, it can be hard on our little psyches, I think. And I'll be honest, I do work about, I worry about my grandchildren in terms of the pressures and stuff that social media has brought into their lives. Okay, I just kind of want to dis disguise those edges a little bit. Okay, so that is definitely something I will use, whereas I wouldn't have used <laughs> that otherwise. So that's awesome. Now, I wanted to, I've got these, um, these from the Stampington paper that we worked on on Forgotten Friends Friday. But I'm just, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe... Maybe the Tim Holtz, except I kind of want to go sideways, like maybe this one. Um, put that behind me. Yeah, so anyways, um, anyways, yeah, so I was second guessing myself today and that's no fun. It's just no fun to, to do that, so um okay a little bit under this line so take your own advice Gail, and just be yourself okay <laughs> Ooh, I, that needs a little more glue on that so but um but yeah you know i need to remind myself too that if people don't like what you're doing they can just not watch that's not you know that's not my problem they can they can turn on to something else um I feel like feel like that will be cute but I feel like it needs like some book page behind it or something just grab whatever's on top here um yeah, so that that was how my morning started out. Was going, hmm. I don't know if they're gonna like just crafting with me. But then I thought, you know what? If they don't, they don't have to watch. So just do your thing, Gail. Just do your thing. And um, you know, part of it too is uh, just coming from the retreat where I completed eight journals. I just need to play a little bit and not have a specific project. So specific projects will come back, but not just at the moment. You know, I think I'm going to go this way. And then I can put that there and then I can kind of tear this down. That's my plan my plan and I'm sticking to it. So I got the message from my youngest daughter this morning. I need my mommy. <laughs> Call me when you get up. Oh, doesn't your heart just stop when you get those sort of things? 
well, she just had, she just had some work stuff that she wanted to talk through. And I was like, oh, phew. <laughs> I didn't tell her she scared me because I want her to always feel free to need her mommy, you know. I don't know if you ever get over that, you know. And then I think that's one of the things why it's so hard to lose your mom, you know, once... Once they pass, it doesn't matter what age you are. Sometimes you still need your mommy. But I don't know about you guys, but I kind of still talk to mine. <laughs> and, you know, sometimes in the form of things working out, I think she answers too. So, yeah. So what else has been happening? Well, yesterday we drove to Missoula and watched my granddaughter Marin play volleyball and she had she had a great game. They won, which was awesome. This is their first uh conference win. And so they were very excited. They're so cute. So anyway, um, yeah, she had a great game. I think my husband had her for seven kills. She plays an outside hitter. And so she had seven kills in the match, which was awesome. And she's only in there half time because the other middle hitter is, you know, they, they rotate so they both can play. So, um, but that was fun. Um, oh, I have a question that I need some help with. Okay, I I like that. I'm just going to give that a little more. A little more. I, maybe it didn't have any. didn't have any distressing. That's why it needs more. <laughs> um, so I have a question, and maybe somebody out there can help. Um my friend Carrie the Crafter and I were talking about creativation. And if you go online and look up creativation, there's actually one in Columbus, Ohio, and one in Orlando. And neither one of us are sure which is, you know, which is the normal creativation. So um, if you have any insight on that, that's fun. Um, let me know because I would love to, love to know what the scoop is and, um, maybe this one, I don't know, this might be too skinny. Um, yeah, so if you have, if you have any info, let me know. I don't know that I'm going to be able to go this year anyway because now that our contractor guy got in touch with us, we're going to be basically I'd be spending my money on um, house renovations rather than... See, that's super cute, but it covers up the sewing. Do I care? I could cut a little off this side, couldn't I? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, yeah, so, so I don't know, and Carrie doesn't know if he's going either, but um, we're just kind of looking into it, and that would be a fun little collage strip. That goes in the Corey Dahman collage strip box which is right behind me, so that worked out great. Oops, I got a little, need a little bit that rat there. Um, yeah, so, anyway, see, look how cute that is. That's just adorable. All right. Um, yeah, so, so let me know if you know something. And Mike and I were chatting Saturday, this Saturday we go to Bozeman to watch my other granddaughters play 
volleyball. And then um, we were thinking we need to we need to move all of our lawn furniture so that the guy can do our deck. So excited. I mean, our deck is just awful. The um, Apparently, when your wood starts to rot, the uh, nails start to come up. And so I swear, every time I walk out there, I trip on a nail. So, yeah. It was built in the 70s. It's, it's time. <laughs> okay, I like that one. That turned out well. Okay, so then we've got this little one and this little one. And so... I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to grab a couple of thicker ones. Let's see if we can fit those on. Ish. Kind of. Don't want to cut any off of that. I mean, hmm. I feel like I don't really have, let me look in my, oh my goodness, you guys look at this thing. This is from my retreat. Somebody loaned me some of those, those over there. Okay, yikes, yikesy cats, scary. <laughs> There's so much stuff in here. Okay, this just needs to be refiled, so I'll set that over there because I didn't use it so it just needs to go back in the completed ephemera and I feel like that's oh I forgot about those okay these all need to go this might work back filed back in is what needs to happen there so oh, put those with those. The filing pile is growing. Okay, here's some. That's what I was looking for. Okay, cool. Okay, I'll set this back over here. Needs more, needs more attention, needs more work. Okay, this is a completed fabric flip. That needs to go there. And this is all like leftover stuff. Oh, I forgot I bought that little tag set. That was fun. Okay. Okay, so those will sit over there. Alrighty then. So I have all these, um, as I am getting done with projects at a retreat, I just start collaging on book page. And that's what all these are, are just collaged book pages that can be turned into ephemera. So, those will likely go back into the, um, into the box. These are just super cute little tags and stuff from Chapter One Papers. And I put them on uh, coffee dyed cardstock. So, um... Maybe I need to start a box of um, kit ephemera that's ready to use. I have more stuff that I can send along. Okay, I think I might do that. I'm going to start a new bin. Okay, so I'm going to cross stack those there. Okay, sorry, I digress, but you know... Sometimes you just got to do it. Okay, so this, I think I didn't use it because it's too plain. The plainness was bothering me. So what if we put this little guy right there? I think I could put something there. Okay. Okay, let's do this thing. Um. Oh, <laughs> big news. Big news for us. We finished Stranger Things last night. Oh my goodness. So we got home from Missoula 
and we screwed around and got things situated so we could watch the last episode. Man, that was good. I just, I absolutely love that show. <laughs> I don't know. It just, I, the kids in it, the actors are fabulous. It's just like, I, I laughed, I cried. It was all good. Oh my gosh. So good. So the, uh, the last episode of season, let's see, what would it, that be? Season four did not disappoint. Okay. Um, Hey, and I think I want like a little flower or something to just go up that side right there. So, let's see what we might have that would, that would work. Just a little flower. I don't know if this is the one, but I mean something like that, but I don't know that that's the one. Um, let's look in here. Ooh, there's a cute one. Too small. Not what I have in mind. I kind of want something to, to curve up that side a little bit. Let's look at these just for fun. Ooh. Okay, slightly too big. Don't want it to overpower the birdie. But what if I took off that little flower? That would be just about right, I think. These are from Chapter 1 Papers, too. They're like embroidered flowers. Okay. Does not want to particularly fit in there. Just snip you off. Let me use my little bitty scissors. I'm just gonna go. Like that. Nope, I don't think I want to do that. Okay, well, I'm gonna put that on there. Did I tell you that we just came from getting our flu shots? Yeah, so I thought, well, I'm gonna do a video in case my arm gets stiff. <laughs> I'll, I'll get my video done ahead of time here. Okay. Now I'm kind of wondering if I want to put the other one on the tag. I do love playing with these tracing paper strips. Where'd my other one go? There it is. Oh, look at how pretty that is. Okie dokie. Artichokey. We figured this out. It was funny when our contractor guy came yesterday and we were to pick out the, um, we were to pick out the, uh, decking that we wanted to, to you know the color and stuff and so I looked at the box he had them all like this and I looked at the box and I knew immediately which one I wanted and so I said to Mike you know tell me which one you want and I'll tell you you know what I was thinking and he picked out the same one and and so I said yep that's the one I picked and the guy goes, never have I had a couple agree so quickly <laughs> on which decking they wanted. I, he said, he said, sometimes I feel like I'm half contractor, half marriage counselor. <laughs> I said, well, I said, I am pretty good at knowing what pleases my eye <laughs> in a pretty quick 
amount of time. So yeah, that was hilarious. I didn't tell him what I do <laughs> with, with, um, making videos and stuff, but it's like, yep, I just kind of make my decisions fairly quickly. <laughs> okay. So there's that. I'm going to, on this side, put, um, Excuse me, I'm, there we go, stretching over, getting some coffee dyed paper. But yeah, that was funny. I've never had a married couple that chose so quickly. <laughs> well, look at us being good at something, honey. Where is my tear ruler? Oh, there, right in front of my face. So yeah, that was good. That was pretty funny. But. <clears throat> oh, I don't know. This afternoon I might just have to take some time from filming and get some stuff cleaned up. Oh, my land. It's, you know, I don't work well when stuff's all in a mess. So, um, yeah. Might be time for me to address the situation. Okay, so now that can be written on, and that goes in there, and I'm super happy with those. Those are cute. Okay, cool. So we've used up that one. Now, let's see what we find for this. Let's look in this pile for a second. So these were some that I did at the retreat. They're just the book page once again. And um, I didn't know if they'd be pockets or if they'd be journal cards. But um, I just wanted to use up some of the paper that I had. Ooh, this one would be really good. That I had. I don't know if that one would be good. I don't I hate to cover any of that up, you know. Okay, so let's let's do this one. And how wide is this? This is five and a half. Yeah, that's not, that's going to be too wide. I don't want to lose any of it, though. So I think I'll make it into a journal card that goes behind a belly band. Thusly, maybe. But then these are smaller. Hmm. And then maybe a label or something. Okay. I think I have a plan. And then um, I had these kind of in a pile because I wanted to sew around them. So I'll have to do that. But. As, oh, yeah, I did that. I thought that was cute on the back. Um, uh, 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 yeah, my daughter calling this morning. You know, sometimes they just need to talk. That's it, you know. I mean, I throw in a little of, you know, affirmations or, um, well, you could do this or whatever but in general I just really think sometimes they just need somebody to bounce stuff off you know so that was good and then <laughs> then she dropped Bucky off at preschool and um she said can I call you back after I drop off Bucky and I was like I was like yeah and then she didn't call and she didn't call so I said to my husband, I need to take a shower before we go get our flu shot. And um, I said, I'm going to leave my phone with you in case Mary calls back. Well, she did. So then they had a big visit. So it was good morning. 
Yeah, yesterday at my granddaughter's volleyball, my my son was very stressed out. He's had very busy days at work, and so it was just like, oh my gosh. I'm so sorry my children have to be adult, <laughs> have to do all this adult stuff. Oh, she's so cute. Isn't she cute? Okay, then I think I'd like a label. Those are not my labels. I know I need to I need to put tags on them. But seriously, guys, I gotta clean up this mess before I worry about any taggage of anything. These are the colored ones, the colored stamping. I feel like it's a little too bright with the neutrals we've got going on there. Okay. This is my labels. There they are. Well, you get a chance to see all my fun um, pouches. Ooh, that one's ripped. But like a big one like that, sometimes I, it's hard to find ones that, uh, pieces that the bigger ones will fit. So just haven't quite found the right one yet. That one's pretty good because it's real. Hmm. I'm looking at this right here. And I'm considering doing two labels. Like so. You know, I kind of like that. I think I'm going to do that. Is that done? Okay, so right about at that line. Alrighty. Okay, and this one's on rice paper. Love that. Okay. There we go. Okay. You know what I might do there is a rub on if I can see one that one that speaks to me. The right size. What about this little plant right there? Might be overkill, but you know, oh well. It also might be cute. Oh, yes, they are. Yeah, I'm going to put that there just for fun. A little hard to cut around these. Yeah, so I'm very sad that season five is the last season of Stranger Things, but I get it because, you know, the kids are all growing up that were in it and everything. At some point, it's going to be like, okay, that's. Kind of enough of that, you know. So, but man, I have enjoyed that. Okay. Put the rub ons back where they go so they don't add to the chaos of my room. Let's see. I thought I put a, yes, I did, a popsicle stick in my mug.
tell if I'm making any progress or nope um, try my bone folder oh it likes that better a little pointier you know There we go. Okay. That one makes me happy too. All right. A couple more here. Um, gosh, again, I'd kind of like. Oh, that would be cute, I think. Okay. Oh, I need to. Well, I'll remember when I pick up to put that in my sewing pile. kind of fun to tear these two because then it gives you a little bit more of a rough edge which is okay, this one needs some extra glue on its frame there we go all righty then let's see what that would look like on this one. Mm, how cute is that? I do like that. Okay, and I think what I'm going to do with this one is round these top corners, but I'm going to put um, a thumb hole in it and make it a pocket. Stress. Gosh, you guys, my knee is killing me today from climbing up and down the bleachers. I'm just like, oh, Gail, you're getting to be such an old fogey. Ugh. But I actually kind of heard it at the retreat because, which I don't know if it's got arthritis or something. It's sore, anyways. But um, I was. <laughs> loading up the car and I kind of tripped a little bit <laughs> so there's that so it was kind of not happy to begin with so look at how cute that is with those papers I'm telling you those Kathy Holden papers are awesome they're just hard to find it's so crazy I mean I feel like with her stuff her fabric too it's like um, they don't make enough of it right off the bat to, so that we can all get some. Oh, I like this one a lot. That turned out great. So I'll sew around that and then I'll put that with my Kathy Holden journals because I've got two of those kind of on the go. Well, since that works so well, what about this one or this one? I could go here and do the same thing for the other journal. Yeah, I think that one. Okay, let's do it. Oh, shoot. Did I put... Oh, no, I didn't. I was going to say, did I put my thumb hole punch her away. Didn't mean to. So let's see. Tomorrow will be Marguerite Miller. So I have to, after lunch, figure out what I'm going to put on the collage. And then, and then we've got, I don't know. Maybe they'll be more the same. Oh, I don't know. We'll just see see what I feel like doing. How's that? I'm kind of starving, and I'm excited because I have my 
leftover pasta salad for lunch today. Been eating on it ever since the retreat. <laughs> I I don't know how to cook. I, I mean, that was eight, oh, eight people. And still, it's like, you know, I had so many years where the kids would bring all their friends home and everything and Sunday dinners we'd have 20 or more so I'm not good at cooking for certainly not for two but um but yeah okay that is super pretty I love that I think I might leave that like that so we're out now of those of those strips that we made so that's exciting. We got those all made up into things. Is this going to be too big? Yes. Shoot. So are these going to be too Are these? Those are a little smaller. Yeah, those are going to be okay. That one's so close. Cheesy peasy. But I think it'll work. All right, um, I could take a slice off of there. I think I will do that. Okay, we'll fix that one a little bit. Forgot about checking the size. Just a scotch. And then it'll just fit better. Granted, my thumb hole may not be in the middle anymore, but, you know, details, details. That's okay. All righty then. You are going to be too big, but don't want to lose much of the design, if at all. But I can take some off this side. And I can take just a little slice off of this side. Okay. I'm going to leave that pointy there, I think, on this one. No particular reason other than that label. I like how that label looks. Now, when I go to use this in a journal, I could put a word or something right there or right here. I just think that's so pretty. Okay. I'm not going to put anything right now. I'll just have it prepared. I'll get that sewn around. And so maybe we make this one a journal card. But I think I'll wait till I have all my Kathy Holden stuff at hand so I can do that. Okay. So, but let's sew around it. How about? And then I'll pop it in the bag with all my stuff for those journals. So we'll be working on those here coming up. Might as well give it a of this too it's gonna oh these are gonna need to be the ones that this one is gonna need to be backed isn't it yes it is okay I can do that that's easy easier easy done let's grab a piece nope I grab three pieces of coffee dye paper let's see Go. Go this way. Okay. Gosh, I haven't sewn in a while. I told you, didn't I, that I goobered up the sewing machine at the craft house? Oopsie. I was unfamiliar with the, how to wind the bobbin on that machine. So, but. I don't know. I lesson learned. I'll take my own sewing machine from now on. I didn't take it because I was trying to save room in the car, but but then I ended up 
doing bad things to her. So probably not great. Okay. So there's that. Now, is there something we can do with some of these scraps? I might, I know, I might grab some of those. Okay. I have a thought. Just get that ready. Okay. So that's ready to sew around and decorate the front later okay all right so look at this giant stack of tags that i have ready to go this one seems kind of like ready to go ready to go i think hmm anyway I think those might have to go back in my to-dos because I don't really have anything. So I kind of like to show you this. Do we have time? Yeah. Um, I was talking yesterday about this pumice stone oxide spray. I kind of want to, like, I want to tone this down because it's, it's too... It's too bright for most things I do. So let's grab a piece of scratchy paper, kind of. I'm going to use this because it might tone that down too. And let's just do a little spray, just a little one. Okay. I don't know if that will dry by the time we're done but see how that's going to knock down that super bright pink and green there and just make it a little more a little more something I can use I think so I'll set that aside to dry okay and then I gotta get a gotta get a baby wipe So first thing on these is always, always wipe it off after you use it because otherwise you're going to have troubles. <laughs> it's not going to spray the next time you want it to. So there we go. Okay. Well, we did that. <laughs> well, there's one less to go in the to-dos. Okay. I don't know what to do with these other than just do more collaging, guys. Let's see, I have another piece of paper. Let's just do it on this paper. We'll just do a little collage to take us through to the end of the video. And then we'll have one more piece of paper that's ready to cut up and use. Whether it be that we back it and, um, oh, that's pretty. Whether it be that we back it and use it for tags and journal cards, or it may be that we cut it up for those little clusters. But I think I'm just going to, I want to get some of these down. So I'm not going to use the super tiny pieces like I did in the ones for the collage. I think we'll, we'll just use up some of these papers. Um, I love this one. So much, so much, so much. I'm going to just rip that there. And I think I'll rip that there. Just make them a little more manageable sizes. Put one of those on. So I hope, I hope, hope, hope you're having a great day. Great, let's see, Tuesday, I do believe. Um. And I appreciate you crafting along with me. It's just, it's just way too much fun, isn't it? And then I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get these cleaned up, the scraps in the various scrap bins, and 
we'll just we'll just get that done. I did get most things put away. I just have those project boxes of you know for ephemera making and stuff that I just need to go through and clean out. It kind of threw everything in as we were leaving. I was like, okay. This, 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 and go in there. Oh, that's a pretty one. I'm digging. Digging down. Isn't that pretty? Maybe we'll do a strip of that. But at least all of this won't go in the scrap bin. At least we will have worked with some of it. So guys, super smoky still here. Oh my gosh, it's been, today's unhealthy. And it's just like, ugh. It's, I mean, <laughs> the lady who was giving us our flu shot, she said, so, you know, how they ask you at the beginning if you've had a cold or anything, you know, runny nose or anything. I said, just from the smoke. She's like, oh, I know. Isn't it awful? I'm like, yep, really is. It's just really, um, what do I want to say? Kind of laying in, laying in our area. And it's just not, it's just not going away at this point. So, so yeah, let's put that there. And I, I told Mike, I just want to be in my craft room. I don't even like being upstairs where I can look out the window because it's just all gray and grayish brown out there. Yuck. So, let's see. What else? Um, I've got this little flower, which, could I put it there? Yeah, why not? I need a new glue page. I'm starting to get a little, little yucky. So I have all the like little last minutey things finishing up to do on those journals. I need to do that too. Hopefully by now I'll have them listed. At least some of them. Okay. Guess that could go there. Yeah. I need more hours in the day or a helper, one or the other. Jamie, Jamie, get your buns up here. <laughs> my friend Jamie's always, we tease that she's my assistant because she reminds me of stuff and things. <laughs> oh. I met Jamie years ago when I did a meet and greet in Denver. Went to visit my daughters and they helped me to arrange a little, little meet and greet. It was lots of fun. It was really fun to meet the, meet the people and everything. And um, met lots of folks there. Shell from the Rambling Crafter, she came. Melody Huey, who's um, on Facebook and stuff. Yep, she came and yeah, lots of folks. It was awesome. I loved meeting them. Okay, so then, but you know, this time we're just going to go see our family. So I'm not doing anything like that this time, but... This, ooh, that's pretty, isn't it? Let's put that there. I need to reprint those chapter one papers. I just, I just have loved them. So, so why not print them again? I uh, say, well, I'm not finding anything quite that I want, but I'm gonna go with this. 
Then we'll have that side done. Then we can do the back side. I've got a few more minutes. Maybe we can get this done. And then, and then when I use them, I'll just look and see if they have backing. I'll use them for um, journal cards and tags and stuff. If they don't, then I'll use them for the collages. Okay, so I am going to put small and bigger just so I can see what I'm doing here. Um, and then they'll be ready to go in my baskets because I have a small basket and big basket. Look at that. That would be cute on the back, wouldn't it? Let's do this. First things first, we'll do this one. Why not? Might as well. Okay. Alrighty then. This is good. So I can kind of separate it as I go. I'm going to put that one in the other corner. Got a little chunk out of it, you know, it was made to look vintage and old with that chunk and I will just put something over that. Okay. This down low here, I've got, well that would work, wouldn't it? I think I will. I mean, even if it's got a frame on it, you could still write on it. Okay. So there's that. Now, that's card stock, but I might end up using it anyway. Okay. That's card stock. That's okay. It's crazy, isn't it, how many scraps I made in five days. <laughs> and I mean, I, I collaged a lot of them already. But yeah, it's, it's nuts how many, when you're really working on stuff, how many you end up making. We're going to have this all done. So we will have made several pieces of ephemera and used up some scraps. And hopefully when I return, <laughs> I will I will have things neatened up on my desk and, you know, just feel better about life in general. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, put that there, and it's not big enough. Oh, here's something. I guess I can do that. Yeah, it's mostly um, coffee dyed card stock, but I backed a lot of things when I was working on stuff, so that's why there's that. Okay. this card stock too. Do I have any paper card stock? Oh yeah, here's some paper. Okay, so I'm going to do this. So yeah, I came home and just started making videos right away without, uh, without really doing any cleanup or doing as much cleanup as I needed to, so. But, you know, I'm trying to get videos made for while I'm in Denver. So, 
is my is my excuse. So, okay, good deal. Well, we got that done. So, just a fast little recap because we're just about out of time. Okay, so we have this piece that can be cut up and made into ephemera as we go. And then, oh yeah, there's a pretty good stack here. This one I just want to sew around and put so I can decorate it later. Sew around. And I'm going to sew around that one. And sew around that one. Absolutely love. I think this one is good as it is. And things go right to the edge, so I probably won't sew around that one. This little set. I'm happy with that. And we've got a tag and another journal card and another journal card. Yay! We got that done, didn't we? Okay, well, thanks so much for being with me, guys. And I will, um, we'll get into some other projects here so soon, but I just have lots of unfinished things I need to address. So we'll be doing that too. So thanks so much. Have a grateful day and we'll just see you in the next video. Bye.